Okay guys, just a quick video, as I always say, <laughs> Ramsey here. This time we're going to be looking at the Volker FM again. It's been a while since I've touched this, uh, but this time we're going to be uh, talking about how to get the patches that are out there on the net onto this in an easy way. So what you need is you need a MIDI cable and um, you need a bit of software called Dext. So let's uh, let's have a little look at Dext. So Dext is a free VST which works on both Mac and Windows. Uh, it comes preloaded with a whole bunch of uh, patches, you'd say, but it doesn't come with the factory DX7 patches, and also it's probably slightly different to the DX. 7 which is what the Bulker FM is based on so what you're going to need to do is get yourself a copy of the factory DX7 patches in sysx format and save them onto your hard drive Pre press the cart button which is short for cartridge because it's supposed to be uh, a DX7 so what you're going to do now is you want to click load and you'll need to find the Yamaha, original Yamaha patches and make sure you don't use anything other than DX7. So DX7 ROM 1 is all of the cartridges that came default with the DX7. So ROM A6 dot SYX, that's the SysX one. If we click open, you'll see all of these are the default factory um, patches that were on there. And if we click load again, ROM 1B, and there's a whole bunch more. So all you need to do, so let's say we want this Calliope one. Okay, first what we've got to do is we've got to set up our MIDI. So you want to make sure MIDI out is set to where your MIDI is plugged into. In my case, I'm plugged into the MX1. And so let's go back to here. Where's that Calliope? Calliope. And there it is, Calliope. So let's try that. Let's turn the uh, delay off. And so I've got the... Yeah, turn this off as well. Okay, try now. So it's that easy, but what you need to do once you've actually clicked uh, send to DX7 when it's on the Volker FM if you don't save by pressing the function save if I change the patch on this to brass and go back it'll lose it so you must save it so now, now I've just lost that patch so let's send it again. There it is. And this time we're going to hit function save. Don't actually not function save, just save. Now if I go to the next patch, and then back, it's there. And as easy as that guys, that easy. Any questions, leave a comment below. Please subscribe for more videos, and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.